Welcome back to the lab, y'all. This is a top 10 with honorable mention decks that are uh, listed on, um, they're on Dev Pro. If you're going to play Dev Pro, you're facing an opponent, unless the opponent is making up their own decks, um, the top 10, I'm going to call it Dev Pro meta decks, uh, OCG, TCG, wherever it is, that you're going to be facing on Dev Pro at the present time are these. So I'm going to go in order that, you know, pleases me. <clears throat> you, uh, like, subscribe, make comments about what you're facing on Dev Pro, but these are the top 10. Uh, number one, what well, I believe that, on well, number 10, I'm going to say that I'm facing is the new, the Girgias. The Girgias, especially this one, Girgigar, or however you want to call it. When this card is normal summon, you can add one level 4 Earth Machine type monster from your deck to your hand. I mean, this deck goes off so fast, it's a doggone shame. It, it, I, I'm seeing it more and more. It started at number 10, but now it's moving up uh, um, to uh, uh, another level now. Um, number 9. Number 9. I'm going to say the number 9 is Shinra. The Shinra OCG deck, the deck that, that you can um, you shuffle your own deck, check the cards of the deck that you're looking at, and there's monsters there, then it has a special effect inside the deck. Shinra, I would say, is number nine. Number nine is, is Shinra. Number eight, believe it or not, um, uh, what I'm seeing on, on Dev Pro <clears throat> is, uh, Yuki Pro, is Dark Worlds. Dark Worlds used to be number one. It used to be every time I, I play somebody, it was either Dragons or Dark Worlds, but... Dark Worlds, I have to say, are number eight. Um, Dark Worlds, they move fast and everything else. Uh, Arizona people just got tired of, of playing in them, um, but they are dangerous. Um, but Dev Pro, I'm going to say, is number eight. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, uh, Dark Worlds are number eight. Number seven. Number seven, um, maybe seven and eight, seven and a half or whatever. I'm gonna say that I'm facing on on uh, is the new heraldic beasts. The heraldic beasts are, are coming out strong. Um, number seven, and it really they should probably be at number six probably. Um, but it's a fight between heraldic beasts and number six light swarms. Yes, light swarms. Special Michael the Light Sworn Lord out now. This card is doing more damage than a little bit. So that's number six, I believe. Number five. I'm going to have to say that number five are the Karakuris. Number five, the Karakuris. The Karakuris are number five simply because the deck is so fast and does so much damage. That once it goes off, it's off. It's nothing but constant uh, special summoning and drawing and everything else. Karakuris are mixed in, especially with Girgias and, and other, other decks. I mean, they're going off. So that's number five. That's what I'm facing, number five. Number four, maybe even should have been six, Bougians. Bougians. The new Bougian support, special with the hair, but it cannot be affected by spells or traps or, or other stuff. Uh, um, Bougians are, 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 you know, like number five. I'm, I'm, I'm facing those like crazy right now. Number four, I'm going to have to say, is the Harpies. The Harpies are number four. Harpies are coming out like, 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 uh, like crazy. I know I'm going to face a Harpy deck. Two things I know, if something's going on the ground, well, I'll leave that one alone. So, Harpies, you know, the quick special summoning of Harpies, people are are, are, are messing with Harpies, yeah, yeah, you, you're going to face Harpies. Um, number, and believe it or not, number three, Ghost Tricks. Ghost Tricks, Ghost Tricks, Ghost Tricks. Whenever I see somebody laying down uh, uh, you know laying down uh, setting a card I'm automatically thinking it is a ghost trick 
or what number two might be um well i'll leave it on number two grave keepers is grave keepers ghost tricks grave keepers that's number three without a doubt i'm, I'm going to face ghost tricks or grave keepers at the present time especially with all the new support out for the grave keepers and the ghost tricks so number three is ghost tricks number two is uh grave keepers um because you know they they move fast and crazy thing about it is i made a grave keepers deck and the grave keepers deck i already know that, that the grave keepers deck you know i thought when I, when I made it i thought it was going to be you know um something fun to do with grave keepers turbo i was, I was putting tgs in it with the grave keepers and and you know little did i know that it was going to be a new support coming up with the grave keepers now you are facing grave keepers necro valley like you never have before you will be facing it that's number two and both of these decks are irritating uh these world i like them though but they're irritating you know especially gross tricks it's hard to even figure out how to beat it but i decided i'm gonna start adding Doberman man of the cross out on it and um even with the gross tricks and shinra's yeah it, it, yeah, those two, those two mechanics is kind of hard. Um, number one, I still gonna have to say, is dragons. Any kind of dragons, you're gonna face dragons. Um, but dragons, you see dragons being played less frequently, um, and actually, I, I'm I'm seeing more of the other stuff, more than dragons. But dragons are still number one but it's not as a much a percentage that you'll see it but dragons of all kinds are being played on death row of course dragon ravine you know uh, dragon rulers um not, not the complete deck whatever uh most but number one of all the dragons at the present time is the blue eyes white dragon you're i'm going to face blue eyes i i know it i know it i know it Especially when I see Blue Eyes White Maiden come out. You know, hey, this is what it is. Honorable mention, Synchrons. People are still experimenting with Synchrons, and it's a fast deck. And you know, and you know, Quasar's coming out. You're just afraid of what's going to happen. When you see Synchrons and Curry Curry's coming, coming, that's when you know that you got problems. Synchrons and Curry Curry's, you already know that's a problem. So that's pretty much the deck. Um, all the other decks that that uh, you'll, you'll you'll probably face honorable mentions, of course, is uh, of course chaos. You're gonna face chaos decks like crazy, chaos sorcerer and all the other ones. Um, you're gonna face chaos, synchrons, plants, uh, different types. Uh, but mostly Shinra, mostly in the Shinras, and another one. So, um, honorable mention also is the Elemental Heroes. Uh, you're seeing that um, uh, they're in there. But yeah, yeah, pretty much top ten. That's my top ten list for at the present time. That I know when I'm play, I'm going to face besides the Rogue deck and the Burn deck and the Exodia deck. The Exodia deck is crazy. That's magical. Library, not Dark Magician, but Magical Library. I know Magical, Magical, the Royal Magical Library, Exodia, OTK. I know I'm going to face a lot of times. Whenever I see the set cards, uh, um, I'm sorry, like Goblins and all the Goblet Housekeeping, all those being played, I already know what's going to happen. So, uh, these are honorable mention burn decks and you know um, um, burn decks and and uh, uh, Zodiac decks you, that's what you're going to face but then I'm just going to put them up there uh, and everything else so that's uh, that's it for today um, uh, have fun good game y'all I'm tired uh, but I just want to make sure I do this I'm out bye